again. I'm Daniel Horner. I'm a professional shooter for Six Hour, and I've been down at Waft for the last couple of days conducting large group scenarios. We've also been in quite a bit of firearms training over the last couple of days as well, so it's a really great experience. So kind of the theory of the training here at WAF, as, as I've seen it and got to experience it, is everybody gets to come in, they get to kind of test themselves in the scenarios, then they get to go develop new skills, and then once they go home, they practice all those skills that they've learned. And then when you come back, you're able to apply all those things you learned in the next set of scenarios to kind of validate that what you're doing is working, and then you go out and you get more training and you develop those at home and it's a it's a good cycle so one thing i like to focus on when i'm actually training is when i shoot a target and the round doesn't go where i intended i look at that not as a miss but as the reason that i showed up to train if i see a round that doesn't go where it's supposed to that's my opportunity to learn something so i feel like that time that i'm spending out training is valuable at that point so i don't look at it as a negative thing i look at it as a very positive thing. In fact, the only reason that I'm actually out there training, and I look at the WAF scenario training uh, in the same way. So I'm here to see, you know, if I make a mistake or I do something that I really don't feel like is the right answer, then maybe that's an opportunity for me to learn. And then you, you get to you get to learn a lot, and you get to build the confidence from going through the scenarios successfully as well. So hopefully this will help you out, and I look forward to seeing you here next time.